We're very happy and uh, to have you with us uh, today, and we're very happy to present your film in uh, Rabat Comedy. Uh, we uh, we have this uh, year uh, an online uh, festival, and uh, we wish uh, you could be with us. Uh, but uh, maybe for uh, no, yeah, another year, you could come to Rabat uh, and uh, spend time in Rabat, and at the same time uh, talk about. Uh, the cinema directly with the, the festival uh, uh, visitors. Now, uh, with regards to your uh, film, I'd like to uh, ask you a first question is, uh, how, did you, uh, how did you find this idea? How did, were you the one who wrote it? Uh, what triggered it in your head? What, uh, what, what made this idea uh, a movie? Yeah, um, so I I wrote this, uh, this short movie with um, with my friend, and uh, both of us uh, we wanted to to, to tell about uh, relationship in general. So um, especially where where um, tells um, tells about uh, the the crisis uh, the um, the end. Of, of our relationship and uh, I tried to, to, to show it uh, um, from the females and the males point of view uh, because we, we have uh, Laura that, uh, who is a, a woman uh, who given, uh, uh, who, I'm sorry for my my don't worry uh, uh, <laughs> we'll uh, take your time don't worry uh, i think you're, you're doing great you just uh, <laughs> just you. Uh, find the, the words uh, to express it and uh... yes uh laura <clears throat> is a a woman uh, who um gave away uh, give away gave away um her independence uh, all uh, her dreams uh, um of course uh, uh, her job her job for uh, her family and for this uh, unexpected child but uh, on the other side uh, she has uh, uh, her husband who um, can't do this he he can't do the the, the father's job uh, he can just offer uh, his um, self uh, um, economy economic independence uh, you know uh, so I, I I tried to uh, to catch uh, the that moment uh, uh, when the, the break of, of a relationship when uh, you you lose the the you, you lose the, the point of view of the other person and the other person become just a, a target to be eliminated. So Guerra Civile is a civil war, of course, and uh, I, I try to, to, show, to show this and the, um, the hypocrisy and often the, the, self, the self, uh, selfishness I say right. Selfishness, yeah. Selfishness uh, in a lot of uh, uh, relationship, uh, mm -hmm. you know, often people uh, go on or drag relationship uh, for what? Or I think often uh, these people uh, go on and drag their relationship, their relationships. Uh, for the fear of uh, uh, the opinion of, of the other person. I, I don't know if I... Yeah, I, yeah, I understand that, that you, uh, yeah, you, 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 well, you are tackling a problem which uh, happens in many, many couples yeah. in uh, all, all over the world. Yeah. And uh, then, uh, you know, it's uh, where, where we, we see a situation uh, uh, being established, you know, with time. For example, one of them decides to, the, usually the woman, 
She says, okay, I'm making a baby or two and I will stop working. I will take care of the family and it's yeah. an arrangement. But yeah. in her mind, maybe this arrangement is, uh, will stop. But one day she will return to her, to her old life. Uh, the problem is that the, the husband, the kids start to see her now only as a, a, a caring mother. You know, she yes. Yes, not yes. anymore. Uh, uh, she, we, we don't want her to be something else. Yeah. And everybody pushes her, you know, but nicely. They tell her nice words and everything, but they want, they want to get her stuck in a corner, that corner. And she feels trapped in a corner. And this woman was feeling trapped. Yes. So uh, he wasn't uh, mean to her, but she, she was already uh, ready to explode. And obviously, uh, he, he, you know, sometimes he speaks and he says things that hurts her because he's used to say these things. You know, he's, uh, he doesn't understand what is happening because he's so used to talk to her in a certain way and she doesn't react like that yeah uh, but now that she has this new opportunity of a new job she uh, she's very very excited very nervous and yeah. she, yes. uh, she and she's ready to fight uh, for that uh, opportunity to fight even her uh, husband you know fight him to death yes. you know <laughs> she's <laughs> ready <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, I, 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 I wanted to to make uh, um, a crossover between uh, dramatic and uh, grotesque uh, style, uh, of course. So I hope that uh, I reached this this goal. Yes, I think I think you've uh, you've succeeded in uh, in uh, through the grotesque. We understand the, the the death of this the crisis and how and how uh, you know she feels uh, inside she she feels really uh, torn she feels uh, broken uh, from uh, all this time she she had played this role you know she we feel that it's uh, she can't take it uh, one more hour you know one more day she cannot take uh, what uh, she took. And that's why she was ready to become very violent. Uh, I think she was the one uh, who initiated the physical violence, you know, and, but so, somehow we also see that even the husband was not, wasn't that happy any also, you know, because he's, uh, you know, he reacted also violently. He reacted also with the, uh, uh, and sometimes maybe he was also playing this role and for the longest time and, uh, and then he felt he was right. But yeah. now he sees that she doesn't like the role he, she, she, he, he felt she was expecting from him and, and that made him also very mad. You know, it's, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, as, as you say, this is the situation that where, where uh, where a couple will break up, where a couple will split, just yeah. because uh, I mean, I mean, if it were a drama, normal life, it would they would split. Now we're in a comedy, grotesque. They kill each other, but <laughs> <laughs> but it's the same. It's the same because the couple, in fact, they kill the couple. The couple is 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 going to to die, and yeah. this is what we 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 understand uh, very well, although. At the end, you you were you were you weren't very uh, uh, you you weren't afraid of letting the the child see the uh, the, the both parents dead. Yeah. <laughs> and, and it's 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 a, it's strong even in comedy. You know, I mean, in comedy, if 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 a kid comes in a house and he finds his both parents dead. You know, they killed each other. Uh, it's very strong as a message, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Um, my my target, my goal, uh, was to uh, to show that um, often sons, daughter uh, are uh, victims 
uh, of uh, their parents. And, uh, but at, at the same time, they, they are blind. Um, and uh, maybe I, I, can, I can say that because my parents are divorced and uh, um, uh, growing up, uh, I understand uh, that, uh, that, that situation. And um, yes, it's it's strong. Uh, did they? Uh, is this personal experience happened when you were uh, small, when you yeah. were a kid? And yeah, I, I was uh, uh, 12, uh, 12 years old. Twelve years old. Yes. So, um, so. So in a way, in a way, you you are reflecting also on that in the in the movie. You you. Uh, so if I understood you well. You want to you want to see uh, you want to show that the, the kid will see a disaster in front of him when he sees when he sees that the the relationship has ended to him it's a disaster uh, and uh, and uh, and painful it's a painful disaster yeah. but at the same time uh, it's also uh, he's the first witness of the breakup of the of the of the family you know yeah. the, because yeah. he, because if the kid understands you know if we are if we were not in this grotesque situation if the kid understands that the parents will separate then it means that uh, he, he he has a lot of pain but he understands it he's, yeah. Uh, yeah, of course. He, he's <laughs> that's why he has pain because he understands what what uh, what is happening, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So that's it's a very nicely done. I uh, I think you uh, you succeeded very well in uh, in telling us uh, through uh, this. Uh, it's almost uh, allegorical. It's almost uh, through through grotesque comedy. You show uh, uh, this how uh, couples uh, break up end up breaking up because they they just can't uh, agree on the terms they were supposed to be on uh, to live together <laughs> thank you thank you so much yeah you're welcome and uh, tell me more about your uh, your uh, cinema experience your uh, is this uh, is this uh, how many films have you done uh, this is the um, the first short movie uh, that I, I made, uh, um, I, I started uh, to, to work in the cinema as a first assistant, assistant director uh, since I was uh, 23 years old. And um, I, I am, uh, an, uh, I, I want to be uh, <laughs> in the future a uh, director, a uh, screenwriter. So, I wrote uh, this story with uh, with a friend, and uh, we tried to to to, to do this. And uh, and you directed it yourself or with him? Still with the friend? Uh, with my friend, yes. Okay. I in, I wrote uh, with uh, with her, uh, but uh, I directed uh, the the short movie. Yourself uh, alone? Yeah, alone. Okay, that's good. And yeah. uh, and you work professionally. You're a first AD. You you work as a first AD professionally. Yes, yes, uh, so, of course. So you make a lot of films, I suppose. You do a lot of. Uh, yes, yes, it's a lot of uh, Italian films. Ah. Uh, now I am I'm ten, attending a master of writing, um, mm -hmm. because I I want to improve my experience, my my knowledge, and. Uh, I've taken uh, advantage of COVID <laughs> for uh, take a, a break from from work uh, because I say to myself, why not? I, I'm still uh, I have still uh, the age, maybe you know, for for take a, a break. Uh, so I have to improve the the skills about screenwriting. Yeah. Writing skills and uh, yeah, yeah, that's uh, writing skills. Yes. That, that's that's very good and uh, and uh, I so this is this is the first short movie. 
uh, I, I'm asking you this because I want to know your relationship with comedy, how you like uh, comedy cinema and uh, what is uh, your opinion about comedy and, uh, and is it uh, for you a good mean of expression or, or did you just change, chosen for this film comedy because uh, uh, because for some specific reason. I mean, we are a comedy festival and we, we want to understand how directors uh, decide to express themselves through uh, comedy. Yes, um, I really like comedy, uh, especially the, um, the, the, coin, uh, the coin cinema. Uh, uh, yeah, sorry, what cinema you said? Joel and uh, Ethan Cohen. Ah, Cohen, yeah, Joel and the Ethan. Yeah, yeah, well, very uh, dark, dark comedy, and uh, yes. sometimes very. Oh, yeah. Yes, of course, and um, I I like the the, the Italian comedy. Um, yeah, what's the name of that uh, beautiful movie uh, that was happening in uh, in a concentration camp, and yet. The father, the mother, the kid. The father was going, was showing the kid that uh, it, it, they're just having fun. It's, uh, you know, so that the kid wouldn't get afraid. His father, very, very good uh, comedian, uh, Italian comedian, was playing I this. Uh, uh, I, 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 I was talking about it yesterday, how you could. Uh, uh, tell a story, uh, very dramatic, you know, uh, the concentration camp, and at the same time you're uh, you're doing it uh, uh, through comedy, and uh, and then it's uh, very well done because because this man did not want his his son to be afraid of concentration camps, so he was playing these different roles so that the 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 son thinks it's just a game. We're, they're just yeah. playing games with the with the the Nazis, you know. It's not real, a real situation. Yeah. You Roberto didn't see Benigni. that. You did not see that movie. Yes, of course, Roberto Benigni. Uh, <laughs> la vida bella. La vida, la vida bella, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course. Uh, I hope to become like uh, like. Benigni. Benigni one day. And uh, and uh, the actor, what is the, the actor's name? Uh, Benigni, Roberto Benigni. Uh, ah, it's Roberto Benigni, the actor. Yes, yes. And, and it's also the director? He directed this film? Yes, he wrote, uh, the directed and, um, played. and played, uh, uh, and played uh, the major the, role. The, yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah, and well, uh, well. His, uh, his wife, uh, uh, in, uh, the princess in the camp. Ah, okay. <laughs> Good morning, princess. The the famous. Uh... Yeah. Well, that's a that's a beautiful movie, and and it shows how uh, it shows how powerful comedy can be. You know, yes, tell you exactly. a very uh, touching story, yet making you laugh, making you cry. And uh, and then talking about a very serious, uh, very serious problem. Yeah. And then of course. you see a movie like that, and you never forget it. It stays in your head. Yes. <laughs> yes, of course. But because I think that comedy, uh, it's more uh, powerful because you you can uh, you can tell about uh, um, tragic uh, argument. Uh, um, but uh, I think that comedy is is more deeply, uh, you know. I I, I can't I can't. Uh, is deeper uh, is deeper than something is. Uh, deeper, yes, yes. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> my, Deep, my, my deeper, deeper than drama, deeper than. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, because you you can uh, express you can you can make you can make uh, more experiments. You know, you, you can uh, mix uh, more, more languages, more styles in, in comedy. Yeah, 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 the, the boundaries are, are very, very wide. It's not like uh, the codes are not uh, narrow. They're one yes. inch wide uh, for, to express things, yeah. 
Well, uh, thank you so much uh, for uh, for this thank time. You. Thank you for being with us today. And the best luck to you in our festival. Uh, let's hope your film uh, will be among the winners. And uh, the best luck to you in your uh, career, your director's career, and uh, in other festivals. And uh, hopefully, uh, if you have another comedy, uh, you can bring it to Rabat Comedy because next time maybe we'll we'll uh, we'll, we'll have normal conditions. So we'll. We bring in the people, uh, you know, to uh, be with us during the festival. And uh, this year we couldn't do it, but uh, hopefully next year and other years we'll yeah. do it. And thank you so much for being with us. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank now. you. Thank Take you care. so much. Thank bye. you. Bye bye. Bye bye.